Foundation strives to make a difference in the lives of children and families. And tomorrow, the organization holds its annual picnic in the park at Fenway. Rebecca Salwasser is here with more. Thank you for coming on this early Saturday morning to Thanks talk to us. Thanks for having me, of course. Tell us, what does the Red Sox Foundation do? Yeah, of course. Um, we are a nonprofit public charity. I think a lot of people assume that we get our funding from the Red Sox, and that's not true. Mm -hmm. um, my job as the executive director is to fundraise close to $11 million a year. So uh -huh. it's a true nonprofit organization. While we do make grants and give money out to the New England community, so much of our work is done dedicated to our core partners and our core programs. Mm -hmm. So the three core partners that we have are Dana-Farber, the Jimmy Fund, um, Home Base, and the Demick Center in Roxbury. And then the two core programs that we run um, as an organization are called the Red Sox Scholars Program and RBI, which stands for Reviving Baseball in the Inner Cities. The Red Sox Scholars Program, Paula Eben actually just brought us the story earlier this morning. We ran it, Jackie Bradley Jr., yes. you gave out bunch of backpacks yes. and just encouraging kids to get back into school in the right positive That's right. spirit, right? Absolutely, yeah. So yesterday we had a wonderful morning at Target in Fenway, um, who has been the sponsor of that program for about seven years. And so we were able to bring Jackie out with his wife, Erin, and their little daughter, Emerson, um, along with our team president and team owner, mm -hmm. um, all came together in partnership with Target and really uh, were able to excite about 75 Red Sox scholars mm -hmm. to get back into school, like you said. Mm -hmm. So we gave all of them a backpack full of school supplies everything from the pen and papers and rulers yeah. and just things that they might not be able to get themselves and um, most importantly an amazing backpack from New Balance so it was a really yeah. great morning yeah. so you're hosting picnic at the park tomorrow yes what what is that about yes. and where do the donations go absolutely so picnic in the park is really the best way for any of our fans to meet all of our players after the game which starts at about one o'clock all the team will come out into the outfield wow. and anybody that buys a ticket to picnic in the park and you can still buy tickets at redsoxfoundation.org slash picnic. Um, they can come out into the outfield, have a picnic, listen to live music, eat some great barbecue food, get free um, drinks, and meet the players, get some autographs, and have a good time. And I mean, who can actually say that they, they had a picnic at Fenway Park? I know. I mean, that is the coolest thing. And also meet the players. Absolutely. Best access ever, I think. Throughout the year, you were talking to me briefly, and I think we do still have time to talk about the 50-50 raffle. Yes. If you can't make the picnic in the park, you can still uh, support the support. foundation. And also possibly win something. That's exactly right. So the 50-50 raffle is on every single game. Fans now, it's new, can be at home and purchase a ticket for the 50-50 raffle. You just have to be in Massachusetts and you have to be over 18. Okay. You can get online at redsoxfoundation.org and you can buy a 50-50 raffle ticket. We draw it every single night and the winner wins half the pot proceeds. So a couple nights ago, we were at $30,000. So something oh, around 15000 bucks. So that's pretty good. A good chunk of change. Pretty good. Yeah. All right. Thank you so much for what you do. Thanks Thank for you for coming me. to talk to us. Again, the website is redsoxfoundation.org and share this clip online. We'll be right back.